Hello there, this is Pete Kogel coming to you from my new studio here at New Podcasting House here in Linfield in Sussex in the UK. Uh, this is probably the first time that some of you have actually seen me in the flesh. It's not very good, is it? Never mind. The reason I'm um, here, uh, I'm plugging up your MP3 player with a video for a change, is because I have an appeal for you. Um, it's not something we've ever done before, so please bear with me and have a listen to this. The reason I'm a podcaster, the reason I have the audacity to stand here and uh, or sit here and pretend that I have a great taste in music and that you will actually want to listen to it is because of one man. <clears throat> that is a man called John Peel. Um, he was a DJ uh, for the BBC, though he started off in America actually. Um, and he was an icon. He was an absolute icon in getting new music to uh, all the ears of people in the UK, part of Europe as well. I guess if you're in America, you probably haven't heard of that, that much of him. He was a fantastic man, and unfortunately, he died seven years ago. And there's been a complete loss in the in the, the musical sphere, the DJ sphere, since then. Some people have tried to keep the ethos of what he did going, and all of us podcasters, every single one of us podcasters, believes we're trying to do that. Uh, and if you are a listener to this podcast, you're part of that ethos as well. Now, why am I appealing? Um, I'm appealing on behalf of the John Peel Centre for Creative Arts, which was put together and is now being run by the patron, his wife, his widow, Sheila. Um, it's been put together in a, an old corn market, which is a very big old building in Stone Market, where John used to live. And they're going to turn it into a centre for arts. They're going to have places where people can perform, uh, where there can be uh, art exhibitions, there can be conferences, there can be lots of things. There'll be a bar, there'll be a coffee room, there'll be recording studios, and hopefully and eventually there will be a place to house John's magnificent and unequaled, unreplaceable record collection and make it open to the public. Now if that happens, I'm going to be one of those people that's going to go up there and pick up a record handled by the great man and play it. It's just amazing, and if I'm, if I'm there doing, doing that, I'll be recording it for you on the podcast. It's absolutely an important event. It's really, really important to me. Um, you can tell I'm passionate about this. So what is happening is they've got a, um, a lottery fund. Um, the, the, the British lottery you know, gives money to good causes, and they've got half a million pounds um, put aside for them, conditional on one thing, that they raise £25,000 before Christmas this year, 2011. They've got a pitifully small amount at the moment, hence my appeal to you. If you've got any money, don't get yourself a pair of socks this year for Christmas. Don't buy that CD, because who buys CDs anymore? You get great music on the, on the net from net labels and from podcasts and all that sort of stuff for free from people that really care. Don't buy that stuff. Take that money and go to John Peel Centre for Creative Arts.co.uk and pledge some money. Do that and you'll know you're doing a far greater good than anything else. Please do that for me. If you love the podcasts, it's something that I'm really passionate about, as you can probably tell. I sponsored <coughs> the centre and I hope you will do as well. There'll be a web link here now. Please go follow it. Thank you for listening.